Yeah, it was good. So, as I said, I was going to be making some guacamole. Shout out to Adam Schulte. He told me to make this video. <clears throat> Peace. Got your shout out. So, today we're going to be making some guac. Grab the lamps. The lemon lamps. The lamps. The lamps. And I'm doing this early in the morning because I want it to be like fresh guacamole out of That's why he make a video yesterday. Oh, I got Fortnite story mode yesterday though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, dokie. That's what I'm talking about. Get the avocados. Hmm, which knife should I use? Let's use... And let's cut the avocado right. Right down the center. Everybody, oh, <laughs> you're horrible at cutting back cut, yeah, not the worst, but yeah, yeah, exactly. Why is it like so? Yeah, there we go, yeah, exactly. Why, bro, it's like so, just a, a little rock gliding, bro. It's like. This thing is just gliding. It's like what scissors try to cut wrapping paper. That's how look how it looks. Okay, let me stop. More mess to clean up. Okie dokie. I'm putting it in. Oh, what's good, Power? Today we making some guacamole. It's peace, fam. Um, let me grab this. So I can mash it all up in the bowl. Cut the other avocado. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. I'm cutting the avocado. Um, power. I might make a cooking channel one day. I don't know if you're somebody from my school. But go ahead and watch my video. I don't mind. I need some more subscribers anyway. Ah, oh, horrible, horrible cut. Oh, I'm Cleveland Brown. My name is Cleveland Brown, and I am proud to be right. Uh, -uh. come on. Let's get, let's get the boom. Right back in my hometown with my new family. Old friends and new friends and even a bear. What good times and bad times, it's true love we share. I'm showing all of y'all all the recipe, yeah. Adam Schulte, yeah. Oh, and I dropped that. Okay. So, first ingredient. You want your avocados. Make sure you scrape it all around and get it into a bowl. Okay, everybody? All around into a bowl. Okay. Uh huh. Another one dropped. That's cool. Yeah. Uh huh. That's definitely fair. Okay. Scrape it all out into the bowl. Like so. Get like a knife. Start going around the edges. And put the avocado on the bowl. As you can see, I did. And I'm going to pick up the stuff I dropped so I can throw it in the garbage. Uh -huh. And do that with all of your avocados. Or the fast way. This is the fast way. Just peel it off and then just put it in the bowl. As you can see, I'm going to do. I'm demonstrating. Like that. Boom. It's dropping in the bowl. Well, I, I think that's the fast way. Don't do it too hard. You don't want to break all the avocado on your hands. 
as you can see, my hands aren't that dirty because I'm trying, I'm peeling it fast, but, so, but um, what's it called? Like, not holding on to it roughly. It's gonna be some. I'm still gonna use this. I'm gonna wash this off. And I'm gonna say, God have mercy on my avocado. Because that right there is disrespectful. Wow. Everybody in the comments, please say, wow. That's bogus, bruh. That is truly bogus. I probably don't need all these avocados. But it is guac after all. So we need a lot of avocado. Yeah, I'm pushing this a little farther up because we fall again and throwing it in the garbage. Okay. Yep, peel, peel. Okay, yep, mm hmm. Yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. See? It actually works. I think peeling is better. So now, get your knife. Actually, I want you to get a spoon. A knife is to cut stuff up. I want you to get a spoon and start smashing it down. Like so. Yep. I'm going to bring the bowl down because y'all can't really see me. You want to smash it down. Mash it up. That's what I'm trying to say. Turn it into small pieces by stabbing it. And then once you turn into small pieces, mash it up. Okay. Cooking is very fun. Yep, and I'll start. Once it's broken into like small pieces, mix it up. Okie dokie. I'm gonna mash it up a more a little later. That's not mashed up. That's it. But yeah, once you do that, you wanna roll a lime just for a second. So it's not hard. This one is not hard at all. I'm just showing y'all. Y'all wanna roll the lime. I'm gonna put my phone. Uh-uh, it's gonna fall back there. Yeah. I'm gonna put it a little higher up. But then y'all. Uh, yeah, that ain't gonna work. Um, right there. That's it. I'm just gonna put it like that. Okay, roll the line. Then you want to. Once you're done rolling the line, you want you to cut it in half. You only need one line for this. Well, it actually depends on how much guac you're making. Ooh, perfect cut. That was clean, y'all. Look at that cut. Perfect, perfect. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, oh, I'm about to put the line back. You only need one line. Um, I might get a juicer because if it's squirt in my eye, it's going to be a sad day. Um, uh, yeah, let me grab that. Bada bink boop. Uh, Bada bink boop hat. The Mario he, the Mario ho, the Mario ho, the Mario ho. The Mario he, the Mario ho, the Mario ho. Frigid. Pick that up, back. Ooh, let's drop down to the floor. Lose it. Yeah. Okie dokie. We had like a small where I can just pour the juice in. But if I can find them just a second, I'll use it. Where is it at? A lot of cooking. Intense. Nothing of what I'm looking for. Okie dokie. Very sad day. Couldn't find what I was looking for. Yeah, I'm not using my juicer. It's 
some lime juice, everybody. You wanna squeeze the lime. Yeah, mm-hmm. I should've did the smart thing. The smart thing with limes is just to cut the top off. Cause if you cut the top off, you can just get all the juice from the inside instead of doing two. Smart moves. Okay, add the lime juice in. Mash it up, try to mash it up again. We'll dagger it into it, I should say. Yeah, now it's starting to look like guac. Once you dagger it, mix it up. Don't forget to mix it up, y'all. That's one of the most important parts of guac. Yeah, yep. Once you mix... Okay, I'm too quiet. Once you mix it up, like this, yep. All mixed. Ooh, that's really starting to look like guac. You want to go in the fridge. This is just to add on to my recipe, okay? You don't have to actually add this. Boobity pop, a boobity pop. Wait, this is this is what I was looking for. Hey, I thought it was what I was looking for. Oh man. Okay, close that up because it's boop. Turn the lights on naturally because you can barely see anything in here. I'll uh, get a little bit of parsley. Yeah, some parsley. Ah, drop that. And oregano. So parsley, you want to do some parsley and some oregano. Especially the oregano. That's actually part of um, the recipe. Uh, one shake of, um, two shakes of oregano, one shake of parsley. Okay. Then you want to get the salt and pepper, of course. Uh, my friend Adam Schulte, he uses just uh, pepper. I think that's what he said. Yeah. And that's what he said. He only uses pepper. So if you're like those kind of, well, I don't like a lot of sodium, just don't just use this pepper, okay? Now, you want to just a little sprinkle of brown. There you go. Just two shakes. Sprinkle around with the salt. And then two shakes of pepper. Mix it up. Mix up the guac. Mix up the guac. Mix up the guac. Look at this, y'all. It's coming into guac shape. Okay. Now let's start putting things away while I take everything back. The worst part about live streams is that you can't edit. So you can't just be like, Boop, and everything going. Okay, juicer. Uh huh. Yep, yep. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, peeling it. I think that's a better thing to do. I do that sometimes, just not all the time. Um, let me throw away these gliders. <laughs> like when they don't, even when they don't roll, they still glide. That's odd. Okay. Like that. Now, what's next in the recipe? After all that, you want to get some onions and some oh, garlic. I don't like garlic that much, but it's kind of good in um, how, uh, what's it called? Guacamole. You want to just Cut through the center of the onion. I like cutting it without peeling it because I'm lazy. So you probably like, what does I have to do? Well, when you cut an onion without peeling it, it automatically comes off like that. Boom. As you can see. Mm-hmm. Except when some of it decides to stick and think that sticking is okay. 
Uh-huh. Yeah. Skin. Skin it. Skin. 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 True. 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 Shh. Don't make a sound. True. True. If you need me to peel your onions, I can do that very well. People without fingernails. Booty nails, I should say. Can do this type of stuff very easily. Mm-hmm. Almost done peeling. Very good peeling skills today. Uh, what time is it? 7.17? Well, I gotta end this video at like 7.30. So let's hurry this up. Yep, so continue to cut the onion. As you see, not a lot of onion pieces to clean up. Don't want to break it because then it's going to be a lot of onion pieces to clean up. So let's put it in the garbage. Boom. You only need one half of an onion for this. You don't need a lot of onion. Okay, get your knife. And I want you to just cut like a little piece off like that. I could have cut myself severely. I need to stop. And then you got to do what the moral class chef be doing. One, two, three. Turn it sideways. One through the middle. Okay. And you'll have yourself. Like, <laughs> when you don't cut fully, you'll have yourself this. I'm finna act like I got a plate because they're gonna be mad if they see me cutting up on the. Oh, what's it called? They're gonna be mad if they see me cutting on there. Oh, uh, let me search for something real quick. Stab you in the leg. Find out where you live at. Hey, kill you in the kitchen. Hey, I'm in the kitchen. Season up the chicken. Finger licking. I'm in the kitchen. Hey, cooking chicken. And I don't want to kiss you. Hey, hey, hey. Let me step down. Okie dokie. So, what I was looking for, it's not there. This calls for a little bit of tomato. Tomato. But some people do not smoke tomato. So, very sad day. Day after day. Push, I push against the wind, but they just keep falling out the room. I do I? See, even maybe that was too much onion. Probably didn't even cook it up enough. Okay, next round of onion. I'm taking too much time. Just standing there. Uh huh. Now you want to get a little bit of garlic. Only a little piece. And then you want to peel. Peel the layers. Or you could do it the lazy way. Cut the part like just one little piece like that. Wow. I didn't have to do that much to get that out. Kind of looks like a bone. When you look at the inside of garlic, it really looks like a bone. I only need that much. Because garlic is very, very strong. Like, when I say very, I mean, like, very. That's going in there. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Throw this away. I'm cleaning this up while doing this so that at the end, I don't have a lot to clean up because I got to go to school. Yeah, I'm doing this on a school day, like early in the morning. I gotta, gotta, I gotta get ready at seven thirty. I just took, I took a shower. 
and then I'll start this video. So, yeah. Where is the knife? So, I'm going to, after you, um, what's it called, at the, well, cut up the garlic. Well, fully cut up the garlic, because I see this garlic is not fully cut up like I want it to be. Very strong garlic. Very, very strong. You would like to get that, put it in a bowl, mix it up. Now we added the garlic. Now we have two more, two more ingredients until it's finally done. You want, uh, what's it called? I'm forgetting. Hold on. I forget. Um, close that drawer. I think, what was it called? Ay! Well, wow, as soon as the fridge is closed. You want to get you a nice, clean, luxurious. Yes. Very luxurious. You know what? I'm too lazy to be doing all this. So, I was going to cut up some um, jalapenos. But instead of cutting up some jalapenos, I think I'm just going to. Um, instead of cutting up some jalapenos, I'm just going to get some. And cut them up that way. Really? Okay. Oh, wow, everybody. Just wow. Okay, so put that in there. Yep. I'm not playing these games. Get that. Okay, and then put it in there. Okay. Like so. You only need like three or four. And I cut them in half. Okay. Cut them in half, then cut the little half parts in half. Who got this in here? I don't know. I don't know. That be y'all eating that. You ain't had none of these. I've had two. Or daddy on the tomato too. What? Or tomato too. See how it's gonna be? See how they gonna do me like that? They gonna do me like that, alright? Yeah, tomatoes. There should be some tomatoes. I saw some last night. Mm -hmm. Right here. Right here. Somebody finessed them. Oh well. That's not an oil movie thing. Okay. Hey, so who finessed the tomatoes? I made a little sass thing for this. Yes. Domestic tomatoes. The very best tomatoes. That's why some daddy throw them away. They were thrown they was thrown away. I said you should throw those away. Those peppers? Yes. I don't know your brain or something. Grandma, you don't see all me now. What? You acting. Different, different. What do you mean? I see my mom. No, I see my mom. Wow. Okay. Okay. Every boxing. Okay. Now, this is the, you want to get a little taste test, all right? Every boxing. With no tomato, you're talking about a taste test. Very sad. Open up my open oh, open up that window. Why did you do the window? It will be at the night show. Me and your mama gotta work tonight. Well, don't you open up that window? I don't know what you're gonna wear for your dress for her outside in the window. Who knows? 
go with you open up that window. Bobby 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 Bobby. He has a nice shot. Yeah. Get you a chip. And you want to taste it. No, 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 daddy. This is my daddy. This is my block. It'll look like there's nothing in it. Mm. What's the garlic in it? What's the cilantro in it? Mm. What's the lime in it? Mm. What's the tomatoes in it? Ain't no little chips of onions in there either. It's right there. There's more than this up in there. You missing some ingredients. You you went into this thing without even having all of the ingredients. You need jalapeno. Where are the tomatoes? I don't know. Exactly. Exactly. You need help him. Yeah. Salt. Ain't no salt. Ain't no salt. Ain't no salt. Sound like him. Who was this? You heard what I said. I don't eat my guac. My guac. Hmm. Look at how much stuff you put in there. Yeah, what's my baby? Yo. Ooh. It's gonna be kinda of salty. Some lime, and you need the tomatoes. I don't believe you went into it because tomatoes is a major part of that. Where is the tomatoes? Day. You shouldn't have made it if there were no tomatoes. There was tomatoes last night. Everybody doesn't you listen, 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 man. Don't, you don't got to come in here to get in this conversation. Me and this boy is having you was having a different tone and conversation with me. Let's get back to that. What do you need from me? She is loud. She is loud. I can hear exactly what she's saying. What? Man. Loud, loud. I'm here. I'm at the crib, so. I'm in the kitchen. Hmm. She's not the squawk. She can talk. Mix it up, y'all. Mix, mix, mix. I'm spinning your ball around. Ken. It's just not mixing. It's just Hell no. What you tell him? I'm in the kitchen. Squeezing lemons. No. Limes. Lemon lime stones. Yeah. My son. Because I got chicken nugget cheese. Chicken oh, nugget. So chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget cheese. Chicken, chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget. Chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget cheese. Chicken, chicken, chicken nugget cheese. Chicken, 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 chicken nugget cheese. Chicken nugget cheese. Everybody likes that chicken nugget cheese. Woo, woo, woo. Add the lime inside of it. Make sure you mix it all up like that. Yeah. Spit it. Okay. Here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. All right. Let's see. Just a little bit. Because I'm saving this for my class. Hmm. It's missing something, but I don't know what it is. Hold on. Hmm. It's missing. I know exactly what's missing. Hmm. Okay. 
He's not all bad, guac, but you know, sometimes you gotta add a little bit more in here. Like, I think I'm gonna add a little more to it in a second. As you see, it's most likely 7.30. I can wait till like 7.35. Like, play some Fortnite. I should have used a little more avocado. Because we see that's not a lot of quack. Could have added a little more. So a little hollow. Mm-hmm. It's oregano. In the parsley. You know what it's missing. Do we have any? Um forgot what it's called, but I know what it is. That's what it looks like. Very odd. Hold on. I'm here. I shot the middle school up by myself. I shot the middle school up by myself. She hates her own stuff. She needs help. She don't know. I'm going to go to school. And all these children is crying for help. She gonna shoot that school up by herself. Nope. And, and I'm not going to jail me. for that. That's a lot of salt. I legit didn't even put it in there yet. Uh, Alright, I'm just letting you know before you even turn it over a lot. Because you know how you are. That's what are the tomatoes? Exactly. That's what I should be asking. It was right there last night. No, the tomato's not there. Even now they asked that question. Shot the middle school by yourself. Because you really, really, really need help. Y'all, it's about to taste okay, maybe. Because this don't have no tomatoes. You shot that middle school by yourself. And that's my secret ingredient. It's going to look a little oranges, orangish, because I just put something in it. It's my super secret ingredient. The best taste of sauce alive. I just gave you a hint of what it is. I 
Talking my baby said, and your heart start pumping. Need that. By yourself, and you smell like a poop. You need help. You smell like you smell like a garbage can. Yeah. He shot the middle school up. Nope. He shot the elementary school up by himself. Sure did. He told Miss Jean that he didn't need help. Need to get work. <laughs> no, baby. You go get. No. Let it taste good. Let me taste it. What is that rest? Oh, are you using that as a substitute? I don't even know what it is. Salsa. Don't say it out loud. It's no salsa. What is it? I tell you. It's water right rice and fruit and grease. I even told them that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to know what that um uh, that, that that taste is at the end? That seasoning taste. You want to know what that is? Mm -hmm. It's oregano and a little bit of parsley. Come here, get your chef Bardi. <laughs> chef Bardi, I'm asleep. Huh. Ooh, 739. Whip, I'm done, y'all. Peace. Every time you see me, you like, you get it? Beats.